Good morning, good afternoon, and good night. My name is Andrew, and today I'd like to teach you how to find the molecular mass of iron 3 hydroxide. I've created a simple table. All we got to do is follow it, and it's easy peasy. Watch how quick this is. Bam. So the first thing we're going to do is write down the elements that we see in the compound. So we see iron, we see oxygen, and we see hydrogen. Then we're going to take into account the number of atoms. That's where the subscripts come into play. If there's not a subscript there, it is assumed to be one. So there's one iron. There's also one oxygen, but you got to be careful. Oxygen is tied up in the polyatomic anion hydroxide, and you have three of them. Therefore, you have three oxygens. The other way to look at it is to take the inner subscript and multiply it by the outer subscript to find the total of that particular atom. Same thing for hydrogen. You got one hydrogen, you multiply it by the outer subscript three, and so you have three hydrogens. Easy peasy, right? Easy peasy. Then we're going to find the masses of the elements. Where do we find these? Oh, periodic table. So iron's mass is going to be 55.85, oxygen is 16, and hydrogen is 1.01. .01, and those are the masses we're going to write down. So 55, so 55.85, then we have 16 and then we have 1.01. .01. All right, those masses can either be in AMU or gram per mole, depending upon if you're calculating molecular mass or molar mass. So the total mass here of the element now, we're just gonna simply find by multiplying the row on across. So the total mass of iron here is 55.85. The total mass of oxygen is going to be 48. And then the total mass of hydrogen is 3.03. .03. To find then the entire mass of the entire compound, which is really what we're looking for, we're gonna sum this particular column on up, right? Isn't that so simple? So this is 106.88. And since we're solving for molecular mass, the units here are in terms of AMU, atomic mass units. And that's all there is to it, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks so much for watching and look forward to helping you with more problems in the future. Check out our channel. We've got thousands of solved problems out there, not just in cal uh, chem what's this? Chemistry or calculus? Chemistry, right? Is this chemistry or calculus? Chemistry. Oh, we also have calculus videos though too, just so you know, and physics and organic chemistry, and biology, and just check out the channel. All right, thanks. Take care.